It's time to play Two Truths and a Lie! Dead? Is it dead? No, it's not. It's alive. Really? Yeah. Look. Okay. I'm not gonna do that. Oh. Why? Don't touch it. It's so cute. It's what? so tiny. What? Here's my finger compared to it. It's so tiny. Don't touch it. It's a baby one. It's a baby one. I'm you? really afraid she's just gonna stomp on it. That's what she does to bugs sometimes. <laughs> it's a baby. Alright, Jared, save the day. Okay. <gasps> oh, it's so cute. Okay, don't squish it. No, we're gonna go put life. it in the field. Oh, that's so adorable. <laughs> 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 okay, go put it in the field. <laughs> Alright. Oh, he's wanting to go see. He's got to put it in the field. What? It's holding on? Yeah, for dear life. Oh, that's adorable. Just let it have the stick. <laughs> I haven't done like anything today. I haven't even done my hair. <laughs> I have been, I would say, in recovery from drinking that, that drink yesterday. I slept for 12 hours. I was so tired I couldn't even control it. I thought, well, because I slept for 12 hours, I'm not gonna take a nap today. And then I took a nap. <laughs> and it was like, I was so tired when it came around. I couldn't even help it. I've just been super tired ever since drinking that orange drink, the glucose thing. Tomorrow I'm gonna retake that test and hopefully I don't have any problems. I have hiccups. <laughs> I hope I don't have any problems with it. My mom did when she was with her last two, she had it. Gestational diabetes. So, uh, we'll just handle it. Whatever happens, we'll figure out what we'll have to do for it. Wish me luck when I go there tomorrow. Another mouse. You did? Yes. Where are they coming from? They're in the same place, so I think you might have my family basement. Ooh. Uh oh. Ellie, say, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> finishing up this hallway. I haven't finished it completely, but it is looking much better than it did before. Here's some of our books. We just need to get a bookshelf. Yeah, that's a coloring book. And see, these are gonna be the kids' shelves for all of their things that they want to read. Does that look like a good book? Yeah! Let's yeah? do it right now! That might be fun. Have you had a good day today? I found a good book! Yeah? What did you do? Come sit by me and talk to me. What'd you do today? Um, I don't know. Did you watch a lot of movies? Yeah, you did, huh? You got a day just watching movies. That's pretty yeah. bad. You gotta figure out different things to do, huh? Are you making faces? And I've got books piled on me. <laughs> hey, Michael, come be part of the family. I am part of the family. The best part of the family. <laughs> hey, we should all get in the picture. <laughs> He told me to come and sit. Stop! <laughs> you had a cotton... You had a selfie stick. Poopy. You had a cotton... Are you poopy? And I smell poop. Hey, Ellie, yeah. come here! They're being crazy. Do you see? Do you see what I have to put up with? Oh, ow. <laughs> yeah, they're crazy maniacs. They've been bored all day long, and now all of a sudden they're going crazy, probably because all of the kids are in bed. <laughs> so here you are, blaming other people for losing a marker when you took it upstairs. I didn't take it upstairs. Then where did you find it? Children do everything. Bad. Whatever. <laughs> you didn't give me an eraser! You don't need an eraser. Yes, I do. 
Why? This is stuff that you started writing down yesterday. Yeah, well, that's not. Oh. And that's not. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's on top of the fridge, the missing piece okay. to the puzzle. He keeps blaming me for everything, and I just blame the kids for everything. <laughs> the fact that you know where everything is tells me that you lost it. Tells me that Ellie was eating this, and oh, James why? was drawing with the other one. So it was really funny. James came in here, and he was like wide awake. You could tell he hadn't fallen asleep yet, even. And he goes, Mom, I had a nightmare. And I was like, James. <laughs> I was like, James, I can tell by your eyes that you, <laughs> this is making me laugh. <laughs> I can tell by your eyes that you didn't actually fall asleep yet because the Sandman didn't come and make your eyes look tired. And he went, what is that? What is the Sandman? Anyway, so I explained it all to him and I said, sent him off to bed saying, no, you're, you didn't even fall asleep. You need to go back and fall asleep. Go to bed. So he went and then like two minutes later, he comes back like this. Ah. Uh. With his, with his eyes practically closed. <laughs> I started laughing. And I'm like, James, you are so faking it. And he goes, I can get like, like, he knew he was, he, he was like trying really hard to convince me. But once he knew he was caught, he's like, you're right. <laughs> and it was like, he almost like, even was like, like he was making a funny face with it while he was closing his eyes it was really funny <laughs> so we're staying up late i got a nap today so i'm feeling pretty good yeah you are i got a nap today too like a 12 i slept for 12 hours i already told you guys and then i took another nap after that but we're about ready to make week 27 a pregnancy vlog then in a few days we're gonna make another one because we're really kind of far behind on this one i think taking that glucose test kind of threw everything off because we were gonna film it yesterday or the day before anyways once i took the glucose test I was so tired last night I went to bed so early and I don't normally do that and we were going to film it but we didn't so tonight we're gonna film it so I'll be good and then tomorrow I'm gonna go take the three hour test <laughs> all right now I'm filming you you have to be nice yeah. to each other <coughs> This isn't a joke to her, this is like life or death. <laughs> don't ruin their pillows, guys. Yeah, don't ruin my pillows. Ah! Including not farting on my pillows, Jared. That's why I'm no here, farting on my pillows, Jared. And Jessica, don't invade his privacy by tasting his poo particles while you smell his farts. You better not put that on your pillow. <laughs> This is the education that we learned this late at night. I reposed. Yeah. Oh, oh. Reposed. Oh my gosh. Reposed. I am so reposed. I All those poop articles are fogging reposed. her brain. Reposed. <laughs> What's going on here, guys? He's changing. <laughs> Don't pull the tail. Don't pull the tail. <laughs> Did I raise you? <laughs> Apparently not. Mom, they're still they're babies. Nasty and they're all babies. They're just dirty. I am not. <laughs> oh, really? You all bark. <laughs> Speaking of raising these children, who educated them on the poop particles and farts? Mom! <laughs> you Mom! <laughs> Taught them all the most important lessons in life. Don't breathe around farts! <laughs> she, she did teach us this. Don't fart on fire. She legitimately told us this, like, if we were right night next to the stove, she'd be like, if you have gas, you have to go outside because you'll blow up. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever do it? Of course. Did yes. you blow up? Of course. No comment. <laughs> no comment. Shinoi, where's your nose dimples? <laughs> <laughs> no, <I'm sorry. laughs> it's time to...
to play Two Truths and a Lie! With your host, Rebecca and Michael. <laughs> All right, first contestant is moi! Okay, the first one. Michael was my first ever kiss. Number two, I was in a high school band. Number three, I am really, really good at ceramics and making pottery. All right. So those are the okay. two truths in the line. Now, you two folks out the there, you have tell us in the comments below. Which yeah. of those three things is the lie? Because one of them is not true. And tell us in the comments okay. if you think it's number one, number two, or number three. And with your guess, leave us two truths and a lie about yourself. Yeah, and we'll guess it even though we don't know you at all. <laughs> That'll be fun though. It will be fun. It will be fun. It could be the most outrageous thing. It could be true. Could be. Or it could be a all right, Michael, your turn. My turn. Welcome to Two Truths and a Lie! <laughs> Today, our guest is Michael! <laughs> My first one. One time, I resuscitated a drowning child using CPR. Number two. Number two. <laughs> I have survived over a dozen hurricanes in my life. Yeah. Number three. Three. For two months, I lived as a mountain man in the woods with no electricity or running water. Okay. <laughs> now tell me, of those three items, which one is the lie? Was it one or number one, number two, or number three? Let me know in the comments below and leave me your two truths and a lie. Thanks for playing. There's a creeper standing in the window. There's a creeper. Pause the game. That was fun. Da 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 da